Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I had a day trip to London and I want to take you guys with me, so let's get started. The station was very busy because I guess there was a football match in Wembley that day but oh my god i loved the weather like it was early morning and the day was already bright so yes enough we got to Westminster Pier we had planned on going for the boat ride um, we bought I think it was like a hop on hop off we used the company called Thames River sightseeing the funny thing was um, in the morning oh the day before we had decided to like go on to the hop on and hop off bus like the sightseeing London bus but the roads were closed so they like sent us a message like early morning to to like tell us we can't have the full experience so we said why not try a boat and that's what we did to be honest i think the best part of that boat experience was like the commentary like um, he was trying to like make jokes or like not trying like he was making jokes and I found them funny so we were all laughing enjoying the views enjoying the sun while it lasted yes because it didn't last long but <laughs> yeah <laughs> So the ladies have done a wonderful job. Now over here to your right hand side, there's a large concrete building with a plan. Look very carefully at the window. Three letters. O X O. For changing buildings, we have to change. Was 
At this point, we were approaching the Tower Bridge. I think it's one of the greatest landmarks that London has. So sadly, I've never been there. So this was my first time seeing it. And I'm glad I was seeing like it from the whole view. So it was a nice experience. We had this weird tradition on the boat. We would wave if we see anyone under the bridge. If we see another boat, we would wave. And yeah, it was just good vibes. Trapped inside the mind of a dreamer, lose inside of all the visions in my head. I've been tossing all my thoughts off the deep end, drowning out my fears with tears instead. It was an interesting trip from um, Westminster to Greenwich and now we're in the lovely Greenwich you can just feel the wind the air like oh gosh it was so nice we had a walk around the university we were trying to go into the observatory walking made us hungry so we were just we had come across some food trucks um but we just decided to keep walking and we came across this place oh my gosh it was called the trafalgar tavern i think like to be honest this was the highlight of my trip i felt like i was somewhere on holiday like on a beach like to be honest i just i just felt like i was <laughs> i was somewhere else and there was lovely views i could see the o2 and gosh just this place stole my heart it's to die for the views how they've decorated it i just can't stop planting <laughs> I 
ordered a good old burger and I will rate it 8 out of 10. It was really nice. Driving your Mercedes, I've been up calling you, baby. My eyes, wow, from the passenger side. Yeah, this is like something big. The hands they go where I go, trees. Swaying out the window, I'm tired. But stay up just to stare in those eyes. I'm not going to put them in the water. <laughs> That you made me want you to forget yours too, too. You're giving me a run from the money, sweet like party. This boat was one of the fastest ships, if I can remember it correctly, and it was like 50 pounds per person to get in, so we just had to enjoy it from outside. And there was just like people playing music in the background. Later on, um, there was a cool restaurant that was like next to the place that we are at. So our next stop was Tower Bridge. We were trying to go and see the Tower of London and see the crown jewels. <music> to be honest, I loved my experience traveling around London in a boat. I loved it. Like I couldn't get tired of the views. I didn't get tired of like seeing the same things. And it was like really convenient just Sitting and sailing your way through to your next destination. and as we were walking i just found this street so aesthetically pleasing like 
the brown, the sun, the people, the pavement. It's just like something from a drawing and I loved it. Next, we're in Tower Bridge. There was a cycling thing. I think it was for charity or something. I can't remember. But there were a lot of people. Didn't manage to get into the Tower of London. There were a lot of people. We, it was late. We were tired. We had done so much walking. So we just had a look around. There's the Tower of London and back. I'm Kenyan and this place reminds me of Vasco da Gama like the architectural design I just felt like it had a piece of it I just thought the best way to make this day even better is to have ice cream. Thank you. you. Open up sides of me I've never known. You seem to have a way that can bust through. Toughest of walls that I've built as I grow. And I'm not really one for What was our stage? Had padding on. Yeah. So I think the glasses. And I think you're changing the way. I know all the things I never used to like, but now I like them. Now I like Minster and we just decided to head into Big Ben and yeah it was the best decision ever because I got to see the cyclists in action. Hello. I was pretty amazed watching them go like they were so fast I couldn't even like it was all so fast and wow that was I was impressed We had to find our way out of London quickly <laughs> because we figured out that the football crowd would be back in no time and it would mean chaos, complete chaos. So we're getting the tube back to Paddington then going home.
this won't come as a surprise all that vlogging meant my phone battery died off so i had to borrow a phone and we went into casper's i had my birthday yes it was my birthday and we have a, we had a lovely time i blew some candles happy birthday to me and i thank god for this far and thank you guys if you have reached this far it really means a lot thank you for tuning into my channel remember to like share and subscribe i hope to see you guys next time bye